And we can see that on future forecasts here, how it's going to keep us dry as we go throughout the day, but becoming breezy towards this afternoon and windy later on tonight as the winds will be gusting upwards of about 30 miles per hour. Now on Sunday, clouds will be on the increase. That next storm system will start to have an impact on us by tomorrow night. That's when we'll see some isolated showers pushing through, then widespread rain off and on throughout the day on Monday before that rain changes over to snow. You can see around six o'clock on Monday, we'll be dealing with some light to moderate snowfall across the area, but this will quickly push out and all be out of here around 10 o'clock Monday night. But before we make it there, we're going to pick up about a dusting to upwards of an inch on the high side across southeastern Wisconsin. Anywhere from about two to three inches will be possible in Fond du Lac and Sheboygan up north, possibly five inches when you get into Rylander. But the big story for next week will be the swing in the temperatures. We're going to go from lows into the 30s to lows in the teens and single digits. These are not wind chill values. These are going to be the actual temperatures, so it's going to be much colder by the time we get into your Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday mornings. Let's check out your seven day forecast. A mixture of sunshine and clouds for today. A bit breezy with a high of 40, 45 on Sunday with the rain pushing in late. Rain changes over to snow for Monday and will fall from the 40s into the 20s. A high of 18 for Tuesday, 13 on Wednesday and a good chance for some more snow with a high of 27 on Thursday before we get some sunshine again on Friday.